They're rare and have never been out of Europe. But the National Gallery in Canberra has managed to pull off another coup. It's bringing some of the works of Italy's Renaissance masters to Australia this summer, following in the footsteps of last year's successful exhibition of European masterpieces. They were masterpieces from Paris and half a million came to see them in Canberra. Now the gallery plans to showcase the best of the Italian Renaissance this summer. These are 15th and 16th century masterpieces, uh, not 19th century masterpieces. I can say that these works are actually rarer. and These works are more fragile. These works are older. 500-year-old paintings from Botticelli to Raphael and Bellini will make it to our shores while their regular home in northern Italy is renovated. And the gallery expects the 70 paintings to be another major crowd puller. And this time the gallery is promising no long lines with only timed tickets being sold. Look, it's, it's thrilling. I work in education, so for us it's a very exciting exhibition. It'll be fantastic for the community. If I manage a hotel in town, we're looking forward to it. Last year was very quiet. So bring it on. The gallery won't say how much it's costing to bring over the rare collection, but it's been given some financial help from the federal government, which is paying what is believed to be a hefty insurance bill. The local ACT government can practically count the tourist dollars already, and it has parted with half a million dollars of its own to attract the exhibition. I think it's important for the cultural development of the national capital, uh, but it obviously has significant economic benefits uh, for the city of Canberra. A golden age of art and a tourism boon for Canberra. Eleni Salters, ABC News, Canberra.